Hi, I'm Matthew Patros. Let me introduce you to our new project, The Bruce Peninsula. Dexter, this is your big brother, Matt. Step brother. What happened with you and dad? Let's just say there's a lot of tension between me and the family. It wasn't exactly a clean split when dad left. Wow, this is exactly how I remember it. Are you so angry with me? You're pissing me off. Dude, man. you've been nothing but negative this entire trip. What's your problem? Look, I don't know how to do this. I don't know how to be a big brother to anybody. This is a film about two half brothers who meet for the first time after the death of their estranged father, and they embark on a road trip across northern Ontario to spread his ashes along the way. It's a story about male bonding and what it truly means to be brothers. In February, I wrote the script and shared it with my team, and they loved the idea. Together, we revised it, and a couple drafts later, it is finally locked. Since then, we've held many table reads with the main actors and some rehearsals, and now the story is fully flushed out and ready to shoot. So back in May, we even did the entire road trip that the film will be taking place in with some of the cast and crew. That means we were able to rehearse the entire script on, at the exact location where we'll be filming in August. In addition, we were able to lock our locations and talk to all the businesses that we'll be interacting with during the road trip. So that means that when August comes around, we're ready to rock. And on top of that, we film our film in two days on the iPhone. And after editing and get all our footage together, we finally have our storyboards and we can see actually what is next challenging for us and what kind of cinematography language we're gonna work with. And I think it's gonna be beautiful. I mean, now you will. Is it tall? Yeah, look, it's tall. I don't like heights. All right, well, get ready. No, I really don't like heights. Can we turn around? We're on the bridge. We can't turn around. I can't. I can't do it. Dude, just stop. We're already on the bridge. Just close your eyes. Okay. Take a deep breath. We'll let it out, too. Okay. Don't just pull in. Let's go on the other side. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we've already licensed music for this film and uh, after the shooting of two days, the footage that's been coming together has given me a really good idea of getting music started for it already and I'm really excited to, to work on this one because of the dramaticness between the two brothers and uh, really excited to see what, what it's going to turn out to be and uh, I think the music's going to reflect that. It has always been my dream to create a feature film, but being from Northern Ontario, I already have the short end of the stick. It's more difficult to attain this dream without support from major studios in Toronto. So I don't want to wait anymore. And once I took a step back and took account of what I had at my disposal, I realized I already have the ingredients to make an amazing film. Friendly businesses who are happy to lend their services so we can shoot at their locations for free. Of an amazing and beautiful landscape and a hotbed of local talent here who are excited and passionate to work on these projects. With your support, we can make a truly Northern Ontario film that is 100% by Northern Ontarians for Northern Ontarians. So you know what? Let's prove them all wrong. Let's show them that Sudbury is the next independent film mecca. We believe in this film and we're putting our money where our mouth is. We've already invested $20,000 in this project. And with this fundraising campaign, we're hoping to raise an additional $20,000. With this, we're gonna pay for casting crew, food and hotels for the road trip. If just 200 people donate $100, we can achieve this dream together. This is gonna open so many doors for other Sudbury filmmakers so they can leverage the success that we have found with this film. And now we can cultivate a truly free and creative film industry right here in Sudbury in our backyard. And we can finally reap the benefits of our labor and share the success with everyone who supported us. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, I like that one, that was good.